Today is going to be a very exciting day. We are doing some bank testing with the C6 Corvette. Let's get it. We are here at OSW with the C6 Corvette and today I'm gonna to be doing some bank testing. Now today I really need to push myself and challenge myself with this. The only time that I drove on a bank really was round one of clutch stickers and pushing myself on the bank wasn't something that I was focused on that weekend and that's what we're gonna work on today. So we're gonna be making wheel spacer adjustments, rear sway bar adjustments where we're load jacking the car, something that DeNova taught Adam last year, um, playing with tire pressures and really just building my confidence on bank tracks. I've never had a day to fully focus on that. That's what we're gonna be doing. In addition to me just being more comfortable driving the C6 on an insanely grippy tire compound. It's the same compound that I competed on this past weekend at Clutch Tickers. It's a tire that you can't lift at all. You have to be 100% committed, which is something that I've struggled with just in my drifting style. I'm not always using a ton of throttle, so it's pushed me to focus more on that in my driving. And today we're gonna have some fun. Again, I'm super stoked to just be back in the C6 format. I know aesthetically it doesn't look like it did formerly. I'm gonna be working on that. I'm gonna be painting the car hopefully next week, but I can guarantee you guys that under the hood, the car is not just back, but it's better than ever. We now have our new carbon creations, carbon fiber hood on the car, and then start its favorite piece. What? Oh, the mirrors. <laughs> the well, mirrors. the mirrors. So sick. The mirrors. So I wasn't even gonna show these yet, but started was putting our new doors on, which we'll talk about. And I got them clear because I think it costs more to have them painted, and I was knew I was gonna paint it anyway yeah. myself. So I just ordered them clear. But I don't know. I just comment below if you like this little. Like I love it. future synth wave clear lens look. Got them drawn mirrors. These are from Oracle Lighting. And then we also have our brand new fiberglass doors on the car, which are a lot lighter than even the stock ones gutted. They're a lot nicer on the inside as well. Like they're just really clean. And I thought I'd give them a chance. These were pretty cheap considering how expensive Corvette parts are. And I found this company on eBay Motors and started, got them on the car. Took the front fenders off. I do have new ones for the car and started already got them like fitted. So we're doing very, very close to paint time. teaching two other people from the Smokies trip how to drift for the first time. They actually bid on lessons from him at an auction that was for charity and today had the track rented out and I wanted to join and learn some bank things. So it's gonna be a pretty chill day for the most part. Not that many people here, which is gonna be great for me. Just focus on learning. on the stick pad. We're gonna throw on a fresh set of the really sticky compound. We're gonna do one lap on the stick pad just to break them in, remind myself how much grip a fresh set has, and then head over to the oval. Also, look who showed up. Duarte is about to be here. He's not here yet. Donnie just brought his car here, but I'm stoked Duarte decided to come out. I didn't know if he'd make it or not. So we'll both be doing bang testing today.
not bog the car down in fourth. Um, so yeah, my last one I felt pretty good and we're already done with the tires. So I'm gonna go really finish this set off on the skid pad, but I only have one more set of the really drippy tire compound that I'm wanting to get used to. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get more of the next round of clutch hitters, so I didn't want to go through them all here testing and then be left with none for the actual event. So I'm running Valino R's, which are insane. Um, so I have one more set of them, and then I do have my Tumo PS 91s that I'm gonna run for the rest of the day. Last lap, definitely feeling better, getting more confident. All right, Adam's feedback on my Bane Fronts was basically to just keep doing exactly what I'm doing and just push my entry half a car length to a car length further so that I start closer to the wall and I don't have to drive up. And if anything, I'm focusing on just staying in place. It's a lot riskier to start lower and then drive up into the pocket versus starting already closer to the pocket. So that's what I'm gonna be focused on for my next few laps. I'm probably only gonna go one or two more times by myself and then do some runs at short day. set of Lino R's. I'm gonna go do another bank run. Like that we're out of tires out of tires real quick it's all right though i took the sway bar off and got some kumos on here okay all right Put it up right now we're gonna do single digit pressures oh, yeah. uh on the kumo tire ps 91s i got well we specifically only brought four of the r compound because i knew i would get excited and then i'd want to go through all of my tires so we purposely only brought four so that i'll have enough for the next round of clutch stickers thankfully duarte came out there with me got to do two chase to lead um, on the chase. It was definitely a struggle for me to like get into drift and stay into drift. So at least I got to experience that. Definitely something I needed to hone in and work on more, but I wanted to do two more leads while I still had tire left just to push that a little bit more. It definitely felt better and just come to clutch stickers, I'm gonna have to get more comfortable with the wall there. What are we doing started? Uh, four PSI? Right? Four? Yeah, something like that. Or three, you know, <laughs> feeling spicy. <laughs>
thank you. You're I appreciate you. Until next time. That helped a lot. Even though what we did four laps total yeah. together. That thing's a rocket ship. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of left rocket you. I'm sorry. Ship. I had to commit. It's okay. I had to okay. commit and force. I'm here for you. <laughs> so that's all that matters. It helped a lot. I mean, even in those four laps, now I'm familiar with what I know I'm gonna have to focus on in the chase. And like you said, I just in the chase, I need to focus on just running, almost like okay. there's no one in front of me. So you're gonna take the number one spot clutch kickers. Oh, yeah, we'll see about that. You got we'll it. We'll see about that. <laughs>